Uh, so we are on a routine mission to Maruf, uh, to a local ANA compound. We took small arm fire, uh, then we hit a telephone tower and flipped as we were landing. I pulled out eight of my squad members out with my 240 gunner. I just want, I just want my, <laughs> my guy back. I just wanted Jake back. It's like what I did was what any NCO would do. They're the foundation of my support. Uh, I don't think I would have been, I'd be anywhere I am accomplished without the, that support channel and that support system I have for my wife, my kid, and my, her family and my family. Going through aerosol school here in the 25th ID was the first time I was in a UH-60 after my accident. Um, needless to say, I was super nervous. I talked to my platoon sergeant for hours. Um, to the point where he was, he just told me like, you just need to get it done. Uh, you, you gotta stop thinking so negatively that it's gonna happen again when you have no, no idea what could happen. He told me to call my buddy who was also in the crash. He explained to me that I couldn't live in fear anymore. It's, it's, it, was over, it was over a year. Um, if I let that fear just cripple me and just handicap me, I, I wouldn't be able to go on and progress in my career. And I took that to heart, and I'm still here. I had four pictures laminated in my pocket throughout Ranger School. And every time I felt like I needed to, I wanted to quit, I would just reach into my pocket, pull those out just sucked it up and kept going. It was probably one of the most amazing feelings in my military career. You don't earn your tab, it's the guys around you, and that, that is the truest statement in the book. Next to never forget anything. Uh, the guys that I was with just pulled me in some of the lowest times I had uh, to graduate. But at graduation, I got pinned by my wife. And it was just a, a surreal experience. 42, representing the 25th Infantry Division, First Lieutenant Travis Smith and Staff Sergeant Carlos Tichero. I had that no, no quit mentality. Um, I felt that I was completely well trained up. Um, I was looking at other competitors and everything, and I, I felt personally that I could, I could hang with, uh, with the majority of everyone. But I, at Best Ranger, you had 51 teams, all Ranger qualified, and if not more qualified than that, they had, I just felt just in awe of everything. My one piece of advice would be, you're not the first one to go through it, and you're not gonna be the last one. I mean, as long as you take it day by day, even if you're, if, if you're only feeling better or less stress 1% every day from the day before, it's still 1%.